Welcome back to Javon Salau Products LLC. If there's no enemy within, then no external enemy can do us any harm. That's very powerful, it's very important. And why is that so important? That's a good question. Because you see, what we respond to is a reflection of what's going on inside of us. But if we not secure with ourselves, then anybody could come and say things about us and it will have an effect on us because we don't know who we are. We not secure with ourselves. We not comfortable in our own skin. But if you got high self-esteem and you love yourself and you value yourself and you hold yourself to a high standard, then there's no way possible that people can say things about you or to you and it have an effect to as you lose your focus, right? You only lose your focus when you don't have goals, when you don't know what you want, when you don't know who you are, when you are not at peace with your soul when you are peace with when you at peace with your soul then it takes a lot for somebody to actually get you to that point where you actually off your path and the reason why that is is because you so immersed in what you're doing you so immersed in yourself and making growth and focus on what you got to do that Petty stuff and little things that bother most people can't bother you because you know who you are. I'll give y'all a perfect example. I remember one time a little kid, he made fun of my bed. He said, he said I look like Wolverine, right? And you know you, you mature and you grow and you growing when you can actually laugh at the jokes that some people make about you. When you can actually laugh at your own jokes right it, it's funny right you know I, when i thought about it i you know i thought back when i was a little kid and i used to do the same thing right but as you grow you supposed to grow with wisdom not just with age and i said to myself man man i got a son yet about your age and i'm looking at him and i'm laughing and he making fun of my bed right but i mean he's a little kid man now if i respond to that is that a reflection of that little boy or is it a reflection of myself? That's a question. So if somebody say something about you and you respond whether it's true or it's not true, if you know that the person is doing it to intentionally try to antagonize you, that says more about you than it does about the person. Think about that.